Hello world, I'm Cop. welcome back to Oxygen Not Included, where we're having a little bit of a oxygen issue in our base, since we're not really having enough oxygen, and that is because we are running out of algae. We only have a better ton of algae. Uh, that's because our algae distillers weren't working for a little while, and I'm actually thinking I'm build, gonna build a fourth one over here. And besides the fact that our algae distillers weren't working, we also have the fact that, uh, well, the algae isn't getting here where it should be getting that much. Well, now it's actually getting here. So, it looks like the worst is over at this moment. So we want our uh, dupe still to build this system here so that we can actually get the algae from here to where it needs to be without our dupes having to carry it. But they'll build this when they have time because they really don't have anything else to build here at this moment so this should happen uh, we will give power to these things from uh, these lines here now in addition to this problem we had here we also have some problems up here with our bunker bunker doors and things and I've actually figured out how to do this, like, I, uh, this automation we have here is uh, a silly version of how it should be. What we should have is, we should have, because I should have thought about what we need, and not, I, I was thinking from the wrong way, I was thinking, what are these sending, and what do we need to get here? I should have been thinking about, what do we need here to keep these doors open? So, we want to close these doors if even one of these sends a signal that it needs to be closed. So basically, we need to say put OR gates for all of these. We need to combine all of these with OR gates, and then the signal from that OR gate needs to be uh, knotted, inverted with a knot gate. Because if there is a green signal coming from any of these, and a green signal means stop, that means that's when we, or the green signal means that we are finding some. Uh, asteroids incoming. That's when we want to close this. So even if one of these guys sends a green signal, we need to close it. And if... Yeah, because right now these guys are sending those signals and... Oh, they're not closing this here right now. Wait, we're getting overheat damage over here in the solar panel. Huh. Interesting. Well, we, that means that we need to dig up this uh, space here so we don't get any more... You know... Heating happening, and we're gonna have to build a couple of the utilities, temp shift plates here. We'll just make them out of ice. That uh, seems to cool them down quite well. Also, we have steam coming in here. We have steam coming in here, huh? Because I was looking at the edit, and I, because when I was editing the video, I was looking at it, and I realized that yeah, I built this thing here that's supposed to work as like a stop thing, but we don't really need it. So we just put, let's put above zero, so it'll send the the signal and this will pump. If we for some reason want it to stop we can come here and turn it to below zero and then it won't pump anymore. But we yeah we just want more more stuff to come in here because we have this system here which makes it so that if the steam is too cool it'll just let it go out into the air and so it won't break in our pipes. But yeah the algae situation is the most uh, troubling situation at this moment. So if we look at our base right now, first of all, why is there so little oxygen coming this way? All right, because you are taking quite a lot of oxygen. Well, clearly the oxygen situation is already getting better, and we are not suffering from uh, insufficient oxygen generation. No. Okay, yeah, we're making we're making good amounts of oxygen, uh, and once these things are done. This will all be much better. So let's start digging up some algae from here so that we will have uh, even a better situation. Uh, you need to be deconstructed. You can be deconstructed. Let's copy you. Uh, actually, I want to dig up all of that stuff from down here as well. So we'll just put this over here. We'll build a mesh tile beneath it, we'll build some ladders up to it, we'll build a conductive wire up to it, and then we'll do another one on this side, like uh, 
here, someone's idle. That doesn't usually mean good things. Uh, I'll quickly do these things here and then I'll check out who's idle. Well, they're not idle anymore. Okay, fine. Will that, yeah, that would give a, this will give us some extra algae, which will make things better over here. What are you guys pumping out? You're pumping out mostly CO2 like you should. Yeah. Okay, okay. What's actually our oxygen situation over here? Uh, we have some oxygen here. Okay, you are pumping. That's stopping occasionally. Uh, you're pumping actually quite a lot of oxygen. Why is there so much oxygen in here? I'd assume that the... Uh, Chlorine would fall here before the oxygen. No. Food has decayed. What? Frost burger? No, why are my frost burgers rotting? Oh, this is full. What do we have here? Tons of pinch of pepper nuts. Actually, nothing but pinch of pepper nuts. We have too much pinch of pepper nuts. So, what do we have here? We have fried mushrooms, we have omelets. Okay, we have way too many omelets and way too little of everything else. I think we're gonna have to. Do some more of these things. Okay, yeah, we need to... Yeah, because the omelets are actually bothering me. They're... We don't really want to eat those omelets that much. And they're the things we have most. So what are we going to do with those omelets so that they don't... Because uh, they're a thing. They, they are making me feel safe when I shouldn't be feeling safe. Uh, so, so, so. Okay, well, there are some critters that will eat... Omelets. Do you guys like to eat omelets, Sage Hatches? Diet. You do eat omelets. Okay, so what we're gonna do for a little while is we're going to remove everything from here and we're gonna add. No, not all. Omelets. Just omelets. You get to eat omelets now. And we're gonna make that as priority nine so that people will always bring your om omelets here because. Well, we don't. We have an automated system to bring dirt here, but we don't have an automated system to bring omelets here. But I think that as soon as we get rid of some omelets, I will feel better because then I know that we will have. Well, I will be more aware of our food situation. Like I'm immediately more aware of our food situation right now. We really don't have much food at all, to be perfectly honest. So yeah, we really need to. Actually, we probably need to. You know what? Let's just. Uh, Put this on all sides over here. We'll make sure we actually get the water into this. And if we find ourselves in a situation where we have too much of grizzle berries, well then we can just, you know, stop making this right for a little while. Uh, turn on this light. And this also tells me that we probably want to work on getting the, uh, well, getting some fertilizer happening. So we need to make a fertilization station, which we should probably build like here, because the fertilization station creates natural gas, so we want the natural gas to come here. Also, because our natural gas is quite low, we'll set the low threshold here as 5, so that we will burn copper, no not copper, coal before we bur burn this. How much coal do we have? We have a hundred tons of coal, yeah, we're fine with that coal. Okay, so, I th whoa, yeah! Yeah, those omelets have really been messing with my idea of how much food we have. Did you... Like, all, all the omelets... Gone now. They're, okay, once this... Well, they'll eat those omelets at some point. We'll add... You know, I think that that's probably all of our omelets. So yeah, we'll add the dirt here as well. So that... Uh, that the dirt will come here. And then we'll just set it as priority... Five, and we'll make sure that we don't allow omelets in our refrigerators here. Yeah, copy settings to that. Oh, we don't actually even need two fridges anymore because <laughs> there's uh, because the omelets were taking just so much space. Okay, but let's work on this thing here. Now we have we have yeah we have four. So uh, we want to build an org gate. Let's work on these things first. Or gate. Let's say over here. 
We're making it out of lead. Uh, shouldn't probably make it out of lead, but doesn't really matter. We'll make the these out of iron. Okay, so here is one ore. So if they are sending a green signal, which is when they are finding out about asteroids, that the green signal we oh telescope idle. Let's not have it be idle. Let's ooh rocky asteroid. Copper ore, sedimentary rock, igneous rock. Yeah, we'll check out this object. Uh, are we gonna launch our rocket here? What is actually what is the situation with our rocket here? Uh, show star map. Mm, you still don't have. Well, you have a range of four thousand. Right, you need twenty thousand. Okay. Uh, mangled saxophone. What? What is this? The name Pesquet is barely legible on the inside. Where did this come from? What? What? Gives a little bit of decor, but... Interesting. And I'm assuming, yeah, because this is entombed right now, we can't get any of this pipes. Okay, let's build a couple of robo miners. Well, couple. Let's build one. We don't need more than one. We'll build it there. Just to make sure that uh, the rocket place is not filled with stuff. Uh, okay, this is an issue here. How can we make sure that this doesn't happen? There really is no way. So, yeah, and this is happening because right, right, right. Things are, things are like they are. Okay, uh, we're gonna let these be here for a li little while. We'll work on the other automation first. So, we're gonna need an OR gate for these two as well, and then we're gonna need an OR gate that combines the things from all of this. So, let's. Uh, hey, new printables. Uh, we don't. We won't take any of this. Reject all and. The, that being broken and too hot kind of bothers me. We'll do a temp shift plate of ice behind it. Right, so an ore gate. Just do it here and we'll draw the automation wire to these. Right, and after this. We'll do another ore gate over here with a not gate like about here. Uh, yeah, okay. This ore needs to go. Okay, we, we'll just let them build some of this maybe and then it will be easier to figure out where to put these things actually. Okay, yep. Yeah, just let, we'll just let them build now. What is Mimo doing, by the way? Power supply to Mimo. What? What? Oh, right. You're right. Uh, fabrication is your most important thing, and we don't really want that at this moment. So, Mimo, operate less, and Joshua, same thing for you. Okay, we want you to build those things before you do this. Uh, where's Joshua? What's he doing? Okay, now you're building conveyor chute. Good. This is exactly what I wanted to see happen. I want you to build these things so that we can get the algae from these things over here. Oh, and we are full of water over here. So, that kind of means that, yeah, we need to build the what I was think just talking about just a little while ago. The thing where we do the uh, fertilizer. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, it's in refinement. The fertilizer synthesizer, which requires polluted water and dirt and phosphorite, and it creates natural gas. Oh, someone's idle. That's probably danger. Yeah, and fertilizer and heat. Yeah, we'll put them here. No, nah, nah, I'm not interested about that. I'm interested about... No, not about that. Wait, 
Wasn't someone idle? Okay, well, not anymore. Fine. Ooh, do we have algae here? Yes, we do. Right, but uh, we need space here, so let's just stick up 4x4 four four space all the way here. Don't really care about that chlorine that's gonna come out of there and there. It should fall, well, probably all the way here ish. Yeah. We'll build a bit more plastic ladders here, so maybe they'll come through that way. To actually build the transit tube to go all the way here. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, not there. Up here and... Like so. We'll probably have... If we, if we dig up here, they'll, they should be able to do all of this. Hey, Mimo and Joshua are already working on that stuff. So did you manage to make this? Oh, you did. So we... So this as it's organic and algae. Copy settings. Okay. Create some algae so that I see that this is actually working, please. I mean, they're not doing anything because the pipes are full, which is kind of annoying. So that probably means that we're going to build another liquid reservoir over here. Uh, but that's actually not gonna help. Oh yes, it, yes, it will help. It will help. And we're gonna put some silly plumbing here. Like... So... Okay, so hopefully this will flow like I expect it to, but... Uh, yeah, cause these aren't working. When if they aren't working, we don't have any algae, which is of course bad. So, but we need to get some extra algae from here. So let's uh, move these robo miners again. You need to be here. Deconstruct this one, and on this side, we'll put the robo miner here. And then we will deconstruct the old one. And, uh, oh, telescope idle again. Well, what did we find this time? A satellite? What? Did you... A satellite. So this is a rocky asteroid. This is a satellite. But what do you mean, satellite? Steel, copper, glass. Interesting. Okay, well, let's analyze that object and uh, let's go to check on our space stuff. Space stuff looks mostly good. They just build these things here. Let's see let's, let's, these as uh, priority 9. Like, I really want those bunker tiles to be done. Oh, wait, how is this like this? There should be a way through here. Do we actually have a meteor storm incoming? Kind of looks like it. I really wonder how we could deal with this overheating system. Like, because just making these uh, temp shift plates out of ice isn't really a good idea. So, if if we made more temp shift plates, that could just take it somewhere where we could heat it down. But how would we do that? Hmm. I I have some ideas. Maybe like we could do a water cooling system maybe. Hey, they've actually built all of this stuff here now. And you are overheating, so yeah, we need to make temp shift plates out of ice here. Let's actually make them like so beneath you, and that should probably keep everything cool here. In fact, if we do a line of these like everywhere here that takes quite a lot of ice but I think that's also gonna keep this pretty cool everything like it should cool down the bunker tiles which should then of course cool down the stuff above the bunker tiles kinda looks like things are working here if they just fix these things 
Okay, I'm I'm kind of satisfied with what's happening there for a little while. So let's focus over here and uh, work on the fertilization generation. So I'm gonna require a manual airlock over here, and let's build two fertilizer synthesizers. Make them out of gold. Uh, we're gonna wanna leave some space. Uh, let's actually check how these are. Like, if I build an auto sweeper, if I put it right in the middle, it will be. It covers two completely. Okay, so we'll build two. Like so. They require power, of course they do, so luckily we have this thing here so we can build another of our power generation stations like up here. Uh, let's build a couple of tiles here, uh, actually, let's build it like this, let's dig up some space, uh, you might need to do you like this, uh, I don't yeah, I think they're not using this because I just set this new pipe to be here, but let's see if they'll use it. Oh, Joshua and Mimo, you need, your priorities need to be set up straight again. You Building isn't your main priority, operating is. I'm going to build a power transformer here. We're going to build the heavy watt wire to go to the power transformer. We are going to build a smart battery out of gold over here. We're going to build the automation wire out of gold over here and we are going to build a power line of conductive wire made out of lead over here jump that go up here and into these things conductive wire bridge over here hey new printables And I don't want any of these, so reject all. Other buildings entombed. Doesn't sound good. Also, one of the most a steam engine. How is this? Oh, right. Because you're digging up yourself, so there's some stuff falling. How do we have stuff here as well? <sighs> uh, yeah, I. Like, this is. Like, this thing I have here, it's almost working. But then we have stuff like this happening that I don't think should really happen. We probably need to build a one more bunker tile here to make sure nothing gets on top of this one. Okay, so one of the things we also get to do here is we're gonna have to replace the airflow tile with a regular tile and we're going to have to build stuff here to make this room sealed because then we are going to build uh, let's dig up that and build some ladders over here. And let's dig a 4x4 space up here so that we will have enough space. Yeah, we're going to put a pump in here because this is going to create uh, natural gas. So we want the natural gas to be pumped in here into our natural gas reservoir. And we probably want to automate all of this, so we want to bring... What is it that you required fertilizer synthesizer? Phosphorite. Yeah, so we want to bring... and dirt. Phosphorite and dirt. So we want to bring phosphorite and dirt in here, and we want to take fertilizer out of here. So we're gonna want to build two storage containers. One for phosphorite and one for dirt. And we're going to put... The this line that brings dirt over here and we're gonna make it bring the dirt up here as well and we're gonna add some phosphorite. Well we're gonna have to do another line for phosphorite because if we try to put them on the same line it'll just be full of dirt or full of phosphorite and we can't get both of them to move. So we need to make two lines to move two things. Our food situation looks a lot better right now than it did just a little while ago. Yeah, dig up all of that stuff there, and then 
pick up stuff like this. Shipping. We're going to need an auto sweeper to be here. And I th are we gonna use? You know what? I think what we're gonna do here is we're gonna use that system that I, that I tried to do for this or originally with the shoot and the stopper thing because or do we wait you guys are idle damn it dig your way out of there and you'll be fine okay now maybe we'll just do do with those two conveyor receptacles seem to be the smarter thing to do okay so we build this here we're gonna need more gold let's go make some more gold let's do 25 okay and then oh telescopes idle again so what was this this is also just a satellite what about here how's how far does this go quite far actually okay I was thinking that uh, if like that this would have been the top line but no okay okay so I have a feeling that we are not gonna see all of these things in this playthrough okay, let's make a couple of mesh tiles over here and then we oh I wonder if you can see through those mesh tiles. Uh, if we put you one lower, you can for sure. Okay, uh, we'll make you out of gold. It's over here. And we will put a conveyor loader in here, and we'll put two conveyor receptacles up here. And yeah, if we just do the conveyor receptacles, we don't even need to do uh, storage th bins. Right, 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 right. But we're getting no power here. Why are you getting no power? What is... No... Oh, there's... You need to build one more power wire there. Okay. And then one thing we need to do here also is the gas pump. We'll do it out of steel just in case of temperature issues. We'll put it there. And then we will, of course, build walls over here this whole thing and a manual airlock and the plastic ladders all the way up here so we can actually dig up all of this and are there germs here yeah there are germs here so let's see if we can dig those germy things out of there uh, let's just uh, leave leave that hole there so we can get through that uh, kind of reminds me we probably want to build a door on this side just in case we want to go through this space at some point in time. So, where's our phosphorite? What are we storing in you? Seeds and ball moving flowers. Okay, and in you? Agriculture fertilizer. Okay. So you take the fertilizer, so we should probably build a thing that brings the fertilizer over here-ish. Oh, we can't fit... Ah, uh, we can't fit one of those hands over here. So we're just gonna have to do it with a shoot. Uh, that's fine. But yeah, I wanna see where our phosphorite is. Do we even have any phosphorite anywhere? Yeah, we have phosphorite in several of these containers. Okay. So we are just going to... I don't know, we're gonna make this bin hold phosphorite instead of plastic. Just because we, then we can use the set, that auto sweeper that is already there for these things. Yeah, and you, that plastic. We have other places for plastics and dirt. We have already have coming in from here. So we're just gonna have to build another. Uh, sure, we'll just go through here, conveyor belt up here, the rails over here, through here, and now let's go through the wall though, 
just to keep things a bit prettier around here. Okay. So this will bring dirt here. And we put phosphorite into this, so we will do a, not a receptacle, we will do a conveyor loader. Over here. Let's cancel that. Let's copy that. Let's... Well, I think we're gonna end this episode here, but I'll do this conveyor rail between episodes, so uh, I'll show it to you at the beginning of the next one. I'm on hop, and this is being oxygen not included. Goodbye, world. Thanks for watching. See you next time.